<laughs> Today, you're going to learn how to make these flowers out of pop cans. These. You can really use any pop can you would like. But today, I am using a Sierra Mist can. So what you do, dig in, you take scissors, you make a little snip here, and cut. And then you cut in a circle around here, then you finish cutting here, and then cut in a circle down there. Then wash it and dry it. And then what you do, you take your cut pop can and you draw a couple flowers on it. You have to do them different sizes so they fit inside one another. And this doesn't take any like stencils or cutting things. And then for each flower, you cut it out, scissors. And don't use your best scissors because the aluminum wears out the scissors. So after a couple, well, after using scissors, the same scissors on this for a long time, they'll get worn out. They won't cut as well. But I don't really mind because I'll just go get some new ones. I hope the sound doesn't disturb you. But. And I've never gotten cut from this, so it's pretty safe. Just I learned how to make this from my friend whose cousin made it up, so I'm pretty sure this is the only video on the internet on how to do this. So, then you cut. There, there you have a nice little serumist design. You can like fix up wherever you want to. Cut there, make it smoother, nice and even. There. All right. I'm gonna cut this here. All right. We've got one flower. Then this is pretty much the main part. For each flower, you bend. You bend in the petals. Like that. So all the petals are bent in. And then you take the top and push it back. So it looks like that. Then do that for the whole circle. When you're done, you can put this on like a bobby pin or a, a hair clip. I prefer hair clips because bobby pins don't really stay in my hair. So, once you have that flower done, you just continue with the rest of the flowers. And then you use hot glue and glue it put and layer them together. <coughs> so that creates that. And then you can hot glue it on a hair clip or something, but yeah. That's pretty much it. I'll do a couple more flowers if you didn't understand it. So, you draw a flower. Ah. So it has a wrinkle. And comment below and I'll answer your questions for anything. As I said earlier, this is very safe. And then you just cut the flower. I wish I could go on high speed or something, but I don't have that fancy internet. 
but it's all right. I'm just gonna make do like this. <clears throat> it takes about 10, 15 minutes to make each flower, but yeah. You can make any size you want. You can do anything. There are a bunch of variations also. See, my favorite is this root beer one. And then underneath, you can just get a little clip to clip in your hair better. And yeah, it's pretty much what we do. Thank you very much for watching How to Make a Flower.